Hi, my name is Katie and we are continuing to highlight amazing places to check out in Chattanooga. Today we are at the Chattanooga Market, a great place to check out local vendors, local farmers, support the local community, go find some fresh flavors, some fresh fun things to do. So let's go check it out and see what they have inside. Hi Mila, why do you like coming to the farmer's market? Get ice cream. Ice cream, that's a good choice. What's your favorite flavor? Chocolate. Oh, good, good choice. Is there anything else you like at the market? Cookies. She likes all of the good stuff. I like it. Well, it's so nice to meet you and thank you for coming to the market. You're welcome. <laughs> Hi Dad, why do you like coming to the market? I like coming because it puts a smile on her face. Perfect she, reason. She enjoys everything out here, so everything's good my way. I love it. Perfect reason. Well, thanks for being here today. Hi, what's your name? I'm Jennifer Bishop, and I'm known as the Milk Lady. The Milk Lady. I love it. We are USDA certified organic. We're the only dairy in the state of Tennessee that is certified organic. And we also sell our milk through a herd share, which means when you uh, come purchase our milk, you'll buy into our herd, and then you can purchase our raw milk. Wow, amazing. And tell me the benefits of this versus getting at the grocery store. Well, the, with the raw milk, it is, of course, natural. We are grass-based and um, also it has the natural probiotics. Well, I know we moved here from a different city and I was looking for something like this too, so I'm so excited to meet you. Well, yay, I'm, I'm so glad to be here. Hey, what's your name? My name's Mina. Mina, tell me about this fabulous place. I'm personally obsessed with plants and this place looks amazing. Um, how long have you been coming to the market? Um, we've been coming since last year. Pop-ups are actually how we started. Yeah. Um, when I moved over to from Portland, I was just kind of doing plants on the side. And um, the Chattanooga market really made it possible to start a small business. We now have a brick and mortar. This being the first market of the season, we've been waiting for a really long time for this to happen through the long winter. <laughs> right, right, amazing. Well, it looks like you have beautiful products. I love what you're offering. Good sir, tell me your name. Dave Willis. Dave Willis, bath, body, and beard. How did you come up with this? Tell us a little bit about it. Well, my wife makes everything. I'm just kind of the uh, roadie and beard model. Yeah. Um, the beard stuff is good for your beard. Your beard oil moisturizes your skin so you don't get the beard itch and the beard dandruff. And then the balm goes on top, kind of smooths it down, gives it a little bit of shape. Amazing. Well, so glad that you're here. Thank you for what you do for Chattanooga and continuing to make beautiful bath, bodies, and beards. Thank you. We've been looking for this booth. This is a local honey. Let's go check it out. Local honey, we know it has lots of benefits. Can you tell us a little bit more about honey? Honey is the only food that never goes bad. It's good for allergies. Uh, the bee pollen that comes off from the honey is good for arthritis, eczema, psoriasis, digestive system, lupus, inflammation. Uh, it's an all around good thing for you, for your body. Wow, what's the best way to consume it? I've heard if you put it in hot water, it takes it away, maybe it doesn't, I don't know. Uh, hot water will, um, if you heat it too hot, if you get over between 100 and 110, it kills all the good stuff. Wow, has the market here locally been able to help you get your word out to the local customers? Oh yes, we've been here, I think this is our 11th or 12th year, so yes. Well, thank you for continuing to share the bee goodness with the rest of Chattanooga, and I love what you're doing here. Thank you, we appreciate it. Hey, what's your name, sir? Yuri, Yuri Ayers. Yuri Ayers, and you do microgreens. This is fascinating, yes, tell me I more. I do. Well, they are just the baby versions of full-grown vegetables and herbs and sunflowers, like the sunflowers. It's the end of the day, so this is, we're almost sold out, so this is looking pretty rough right now. Okay. But uh, the, the advantage to them is you have the convenience of just sprinkling them in your salad instead of having to do a lot of chopping. And you also have a lot more density, nu nutrient density. Right. I love the texture of them. They're tender. They're not crunchy and hard to eat. I've eaten them on a hot dog before, so. So, <laughs> so it justifies the hot dog. Yes, exactly. It justifies the hot dog. That, and the question is, after I shave them off, do they grow back? And the answer is no. Well, thank you for doing what you do for the Chattanooga area and it sounds delicious. So this is my daughter. Hi, Hannah. Hi. What do you like so far about the market? 
I like how big it is and all the food and I like seeing people, yeah. like my friends. See some, some familiar faces here? Yeah. It's a great place to like meet people and just kind of hang out? Yeah. This is my daughter Ava. Ava, what did you like so far about the market? Um, I liked the pretzels. That was really good. Also, we walked around a lot. It was really fun to see everything. Yeah. Did you see any familiar faces? Um, yes. Yeah, it's fun to see friends, right? When you yeah. come to, yeah. yeah. Opening weekend of the Chattanooga Market. Yeah, I have my family here. What did you guys think? I thought it was lots of fun. What did you think? It was great. Yeah? Yeah, it was fun. Yeah? You think we'll come back next weekend? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> of course. We loved it. Lots of good food, lots of great vendors, and great meeting people, too. So anyway, Chattanooga Market, we loved it. Make sure you check us out on Chat Guide, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, all the places. And check me out on social at Katie Bulmer Life. Thanks for being here. Thank you.